Ahoy sailors, welcome aboard. Today we're looking at a One Piece Ultra deck with three captains, otherwise known as ST10, as you see down there. And this is the first Ultra deck to be introduced to One Piece. Now it's just as big as a regular deck, but like it's extra wide, or long, yeah, extra long. Yeah, but we got Luffy, Kid, and Law on the cover. We got Luffy on the sides as well. And deck contents on the back, but that doesn't really matter. We don't really tell you what's in the box anymore. But yeah, we're just gonna get right in here. Now, I'm guessing this is gonna be a standard for all the decks. You get a deck box. I already opened this, it's just the first recording wasn't very good, so we're redoing that. But yeah, uh, we got Luffy on the front, we got Law on the left, and we got Kid on the right. On the front, of course. And of course, we got the logo on the back. So, we got this piece of cardboard inside. Wow. And the deck. Now, this deck is entirely shiny and very, very exciting. Like, very exciting. We got three leaders in here. We got Law, which is highly serviceable, very good leader. We got Luffy, which is arguably better than the Law, but like, just as good. And Kid, like, look at these. Like, wow. You see that shine? This is why I'm redoing this video. I didn't show the shine on these cards very good last time. But like, look. Look at that. That is beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Now, ST13 pre-orders are up, and that's the three brothers. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be the same type of deal. Three leaders, all entirely shiny deck. New standard going forward. Very exciting. Now we got the Rusher of Luffy. This is Luffy's first 10 cost to be introduced to the game. And, like, it... It looks broken on paper, but I've heard it's not as good as it is, but whatever. Very nice card. We got Law, which is just as beautiful. Look at that. Wow. Very good card. Oh yeah, like, you need to get two of these, like, if you want to be, like, really competitive with it, but it doesn't really matter. And then we got Kid. Now those are all times two. Now here we go, we got Rush Zoro at four. This card was so expensive for so long, and today that might change, because he is highly available. Here we go, we got Searcher Nami, very good card. Like, actually she just got banned, which is a little unfortunate, but she'll be unbanned next month, so you'll be able to run her again at least. But yeah, very good. And we got Sanji, this is a new card. This is, this is a very nice card, I, I like that a lot. I don't know how good this actually is, but whatever. As long as you got a new card, that's all that matters. And then we get Jinbei, which is only a two from like the other straw hats. And it's beautiful. And he's a two-fake counter, so it's always a plus. Now we got into the purple, which is gonna be Law and Kid Screws. So we got Killer. I don't actually know how good these cards are. I, I know all the red cards are overall pretty good. Shachi and Penguin. This is a weird one. Like, I don't know if this card is going to be usable. Because it costs four cards, and it says if you have three or less Dawn cards on your field when you play them. So I don't really understand how that works, but I'm sure we're... there's got to be something in here. I'm sure... They must synergize with Law. Yeah, that must be it. But, yeah. And then we got Jean Bart, another Hearts Pirate character, also at four. We got Heat. This card is so good. I've been playing around with it on the Sim, and yeah, very good card. We got Beppo at four. Wire also at four. And that does it for the cruise. Now we got some event cards here. We got Gum Gomuno Giant Sumo Slap. That looks painful. And Gum Gum Kong Gatling. At two. Punk Thighs at two. And last. And I guess also least really are the Dawn cards, which are shiny, so maybe not the least, but I mean, they're Dawn cards in the end, so whatever. But yeah, those are pretty, and you gotta use them if you got them, because I mean, look, 10 shiny Dawn cards that all match. Who doesn't like that? Anyway, that does it for this one. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Bye bye.